So we're here today to show you briefly how to pack your instrument for shipping. And the first thing we need to do is make sure that your instrument is secure in the case. So put your violin in there and you'll notice that it's a little bit loose in there. So we're going to put a few pieces of foam around the violin just to make sure that it doesn't move around during shipping. Uh, next, make sure that the neck strap is securely fastened or tied down, whichever system you have in your case. Uh, the following thing we need to do is to add two pieces of foam either side of the bridge, just in the event that the bridge collapses during shipment. It, uh, the, the foam will cushion uh, the blow on the top of the violin. And you put these here, like this. And the only other thing that I'd recommend is that the foam not touch the top of the violin, especially during the summer months when the varnish sometimes uh, softens up briefly and the foam will leave an impression on the top of the instrument. If you're shipping during the winter months, we highly recommend that you put your dampet in the instrument. If it's in transit and it's very cold, sitting in a UPS truck somewhere, this will help keep the moisture levels at uh, suitable a suitable level so that your instrument doesn't dry out and crack. And if you've received an instrument from us, there are packing instructions. Please fill out the card and include all your information in with the violin so we know who it was from. Finally, close up your instrument. So. So the next phase is to get a box that will hold the violin case and some bubble wrap to put around your instrument. The shipping companies have requested that we use two layers of bubble wrap and so we're going to take the bubble wrap, put it around so it covers your instrument case twice and secure each side with a little bit of tape so it doesn't come around. And then one more to cover the other end. Paper, peanuts, other bits of uh, packing that you have, and to finish filling all the voids in the box until everything is nice and full. Seal the box up. The one thing we recommend is that you put straps of tape this way across, stops the box from opening that way, before you seal it up through the through the longitudinal section. And if you uh, need any more information, you can either call us or look at the uh, printed uh, version that's on our website.